Please. Her name is Sibel. If she has a last name, she isn't saying. His name is Botilus, pronounced like he is without his bow tie. Together, they are Samsonite and Delight Ya. He's Samsonite. We build ourselves as the cheesiest accordion duo in the world. We're all <laughs> packaging no product. Product placement. <laughs> I spent most of my time just making the promo. I am making some delightful prize giveaways for our Sam's Night and Delight You gig. These are cheesy corn shakers. And we call them that because they're cheesy and there's popcorn inside. <laughs> Packaging, no product. <laughs> Shh. And on that farm, we have some horses. We got you know, with an ear. Market. That's right. Let's see who we run into, shall we? <gasps> Why, here's my accordionist, Botilus. Yeah. He might do a song. Maybe. We'll see. Should we walk around and, and just mingle with the people? Let's do that. <laughs> Hi. It was easy because I've had a lot of her recordings for um, many years. She's been a Marilyn Monroe fan. Okay, let's go. Thank when I met her, she has like tons of posters. And yeah, so I've listened to it, and I've absorbed a lot of the Maryland stuff, just anyway. And she already knew the words, happy birthday, so yeah. she had it, you know. <laughs> there you go. Happy birthday, Mr. President. What, what is this thing? This is an accordion jukebox. There is an actual human being inside this box who will play any song that you request from this list after you stick a quarter in quarter the slot. Okay. And does this go to a good cause? Yeah, it goes to the Starving for Attention Accordionist Fund. Oh, good. That's okay. Uh, Decisions. There's so many songs to choose How from. about Y2KYMCA? What's that? Why, that, my friend, is a song that he has done new lyrics to the Village People's YMCA. Does it have something to do with this? Why, it does. Okay, okay. here's my quarter. <laughs> oh! If this song sounds familiar, other than the original YMCA, I mean, you may have heard it all over NPR when it was released during the famous calendar change period. I survived! But wait, you, we're not you, finished listing what they do. Really Botilus has his own brand of solo music. <laughs> Sibel has a very unique, well, you could call it performance art. She calls it Miss Sibelvis Monroe. Thank you. Thank you very much. So here we are backstage. Ooh. In the green room. You know why they call it the green room? Because it's mostly green. I'm green with envy because I'm only the opener at this stage of my career. 
But anyway, would you like to see what it takes to prepare to become a fabulous opening act? Well, let's see, what do we have? We've got the hair, the box of accoutrements, and most of them flash because you can never have too many sparkly things, eh? I got a new pair of earrings just for tonight, too. The very, very, very sparkly. Ooh, ah. Of course, my earlobes will be down around my ankles by the end of the evening after wearing them. Purse. I will be looking kind of almost like that, hopefully, in a little while. I know it's hard to tell right now, but uh, that's because you haven't seen the magic of makeup, or as I call it, spackle. The hardware. Sparkly bits. Ooh. Um, um, uh. Look into the magic eight ball. Will we have a good show? Yes! What do you think? Would this be too much? No, too much? It's too much just the right amount? I don't think I've got enough room on my arms to... All systems go. <laughs> okay, all systems. Now we're going. Woo! I don't need no stinking spotlight. Okay, yes, I do. So how's my hair? Does it look good all the way around? It's fab. Oh, I forgot my nail polish. Oh my goodness, what do you think? Ten minutes till, is it gonna happen? I don't think this is good for OPB. I think this is too much. That's right, yes, I'm in the character now. Mm -hmm. As soon as I put on the outfit, that's right. The Chanel number no. five. Once I have this on, then I'm in character. Just you, nobody else but you. I want to be loved by you. Love, boo boo, be do. These two have been a couple for 16 years. Just you, nobody else but you. Well, what's the secret? <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know. We, we both want the same thing. We like, we like entertaining and having fun and not really being tied down and... Yeah. Yes, we're not actually married. We've been, had two ceremonies though. <laughs> but I do wear a no pest strip. <laughs> Did you think we were finished telling you what they do? No. Sabelle also sleep. makes sense sells earrings. These are birth control pill placebo earrings. They're actual birth control pill placebos. You can tell by the little dates there that are around them. And if you actually eat these, they won't hurt you. They won't do anything, and you might actually have a baby. I don't know. <laughs> Not by eating them, but. <laughs> the ones I sell the most of are the origami money shirts. They're good in an emergency. They go over really well in casinos, too, in case you're down to your last buck. The ones that I'm wearing are of me, of course. And, uh... They're, they're both Tyler's favorite. He has a whole line of just, just one earring that he'll wear uh, pictures of me. Not quite as large, because, you know, he's a manly man and all that. Let's see, what have we forgotten? Oh, how did Bo Tylus get his name? It's now his legal name. I couldn't find my bow tie one day, so I, was, I had to go to work. I said, I'm Bo Tylus today. I said, hey. And we we're, just change the spelling around. We were trying to find a name like, you know, like Sting or something cool. So we're like, how about Drain? Or we, we, we were driving through, or, you know, we saw the town Drain and said, hey, that's kind of hey, weird. Drains, man. that's kind of funny, yeah. We we're like, mm, yeah, not quite. Yeah. And, and that, was, that was one of those things we were just like, for a while, we we're like, oh, we got to come up with something cooler or something more original. And then he just he showed up for work and he was like, I forgot my bow tie. So, oh, I'm just going to be bow tie today. And we, were, we looked at each other and we we're like, that's good. Oh, that's it!
like when people say, well, how did you come up with that? Or who decided that? It's like, Psh, it just happens. We don't know. Can't say. <laughs> It's like you should be on one of those mystery shows. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>